one of the best preserved and largest Roman temple complexes in the world. This is the Temple of the Gods. Located 90 kilometers east of the capital Beirut, this UNESCO World Heritage Site has witnessed the rise and fall of many civilizations for over 2,000 years. Dubbed the City of the Sun by Alexander the Great, this site is home to the oldest of Lebanon's summer festivals, an event launched in 1956 by the then-president Kamil Shamoun, who wanted to create a stage in Lebanon to showcase innovative performances by local and international artists alike. The internationally renowned Baalbek Festival has hosted a wide array of Lebanese and global artists for decades, like Feirouz, Um Kulthum, Placido Domingo, and Sting. In 2012, the event was forced to change location due to the Syrian war taking a place around 50 kilometers away, and the president of the festival believed that the show must go on. To explain our resistance, we had to move some shows to Beirut to keep the name of the festival alive. But it's to come back with more uh, determination, let's say. The highlights, if we can talk, it's the importance of uh, bringing the level to an international level with Lebanese participation. In the lineup of artists this year is Georges Chabaz, a Lebanese actor and comedian known for his dark humor. His play, El Maiza, or Except If, is the highlight of this year's festival. And it tells the story of residents living in an old building on the verge of collapsing. Its inhabitants come from various religious backgrounds, which is common in Lebanon. But their opposing views in the matter causes an even greater rift. I went backstage to sit down with the multi-talented artist to discover the different layers of his work. Unfortunately, there is an old-fashioned look to different people in our community. The play imitates reality very directly. For this play, there are several dimensions. The first dimension, a theater simulates reality where the action of the play takes place in the building. The second dimension is the orchestra, where the music that simulates fantasy. The third dimension, Baalbek columns, the history with 3D mappings. The greatness of this place is reminiscent of its stone history, the days of the Romans or its artistic and cultural history. Khabbaz worked with 90 artists to deliver this spectacle with acting, dancing and singing. It was specifically created for Baalbek's theater space, with some artists performing here for the first time. The feel when I play, it's really special. It's, it's happened just here. Whilst many talented performers have made their debut at Baalbek this year, many of the audience are first-timers too. And in all, more than 2,500 people came together to embrace the festival spirit of inclusion and experience what's like when an ancient historical sitting meets the modern arts. <laughs> I'm a good guy, 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 I'm a